this week's spicy sermon is on not letting things ruin other things. So for instance, like I was, you know, I during my lunch breaks at work, I go in and sit in, sit in the car, I watch a little YouTube, you know, kind of have some peace and quiet, like where I work, you know, there's machines going off, on, off, off and on all the time. So it's kind of nice to be in like a peaceful environment. Um, I'll eat uh, my little lunch. I eat a handful of like peanut butter pretzels, a handful of blueberries every day for lunch. So I'm eating my blueberries, right? And everything, like they're, they're gorgeous. I get them from the local farmer's market here in Hartwell. It's great. They're always amazing, and I got like in the, in and half like you know part of the little handful that I'm eating. I get a, just an incredible bitterness, and one of the one of the berries was just it just wasn't maybe it wasn't ripe, maybe uh, you know maybe there's not enough water in that blueberry, maybe it got hit by the sun a little harder than the other blueberries. Um, it didn't. It didn't, but that blueberry didn't stop me from, A, eating more blueberries. And it didn't stop me from enjoying the rest of my lunch. When you wake up in the morning, no matter what you're facing, you're, you're, you get to wake up. You get to experience the day. Everybody gets that. And... you've been given a gift that's why it's called the present like I know that's kind of played out but it's it's a reality the present is a gift and, and some of us are too focused about what's happened in the past or what's happened in the future you know you could be thinking about that blueberry that last blueberry mouthful that you had because there was one bitter blueberry in it and now you're worried about you know future handfuls of blueberries or or how the rest of your lunch is going to go just know that you like blueberries and that next handful of blueberries is probably going to be fantastic. Don't let the past hurt you. Let it propel you. And don't be worried about the future. Just focus on what you're doing right now. And if, you, if you're doing things right, the future will be good. It will. If you're pushing yourself, if you're, if you're not, uh, you know, if you're, you're pushing yourself on any kind of level and you're bettering yourself and you're sticking to what you need to do to you know whether it's you know paying rent or whatever whatever your accomplishments are that you need to you know you those are your goals each month that you have to do usually for all, pretty much all of us is bills <laughs> but um you know if you're doing everything that you need to do everything will work out it will it, it always does i know for me i've i've, I've been in some less than perfect situations I've done what I needed to do in those situations and I've always gotten better for it and it's always worked out so you don't get thrown what you can't handle so a bitter blueberry don't let that ruin the rest of your blueberries for the rest of your day the rest of your life it's a spicy sermon for this Sunday <laughs>